What's up everyone, welcome back to the channel. So in my last video, we saw how Oliver and Mark reconciled and have a kind of understanding about killing. Well, today we're diving into issue 54 where things get a little tiny whiny. Buckle up because we're about to see Mark's date night with Eve get absolutely crashed by future heroes. So, Mark's whisking Eve away to the City of Lights for a romantic getaway. They're strolling down the Champs-Élysées. Love is in the air. But then, bam, two weirdos in weird costumes attack. It's Fightmaster and Dropkick, and they look like they just rolled out of a bad 80s sci-fi movie. Mark's ready to throw down, but he's totally confused when they beg for his help. Turns out, they're not villains, they're heroes from the future. Crazy, huh? They need Mark to stop their future king, who becomes a total tyrant. Of course, things get even crazier. They can't risk messing with the timeline by taking Eve, so she has to stay behind. Sorry, Eve. Mark suits up, and another Mark pops out to take them to the future. Futureception. But before they can even process that, robot cops show up. Talk about a welcome party. Fightmaster explains the future's a dystopian nightmare ruled with an iron fist. This king, well, let's just say Mark gets a huge surprise when he sees who it is. The Immortal. Turns out, Immortal left Earth centuries ago. He's old, disillusioned, and basically lost his freaking mind. He even asks Mark to kill him. This is some messed up stuff, people. Immortal reveals some dark secrets. He's committed horrible acts, doesn't care about humanity anymore, and wait for it. He thinks Mark is the future emperor of the Viltrum Empire, which made Mark very confused. Enraged, Mark does something unthinkable. He tears Immortal's head clean off. But hold on, there's a catch. Turns out Immortal just keeps coming back. He's basically unkillable. Fightmaster and Dropkick explain how their resistance movement is winning, but Mark has to figure out how to stop the endless cycle of Immortal's return. He realizes that living too long drove Immortal insane. A cautionary tale for sure. Our heroes zip back to his own time, and Mark's a little shaken. He brushes it off with Eve, but the experience clearly affected him. They travel the world together, solidifying their love for each other. This issue ends with Mark and Eve stronger than ever, but the future remains uncertain. Who knows what other crazy stuff awaits them? That's it for this issue, Invincible fam. What a wild ride, right? Did you see that immortal twist coming? Let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And don't forget to like and subscribe for more epic Invincible breakdowns.